for our mate for medal out of the Olympics. Seventh in Germany, take a 12 round split decision. Yeah, the fight could have gone either way, but I don't think it was a bad decision. I thought the judges correctly ruled that Katalnik had, e had eked it out. Good action fight the whole time. Maidana pressure, pressure, pressured. And Katalnik responded. Talented fighter. He consistently, and it led to that right uppercut against the normally career. That was the first knockdown. And this was the end. James in Sydney at 132 pounds. A set of gym. He's in shape. But well, he had he said his motivation. 31 victories, including 13 knockouts. Devin Alexander. Bay. And speed as they time it. <laughs> Punching all the time. Offensive position when his opponent are background. He lost in the trials to Rock Allen in a tiebreaker. Katelnik. His camp was he's going to come forward, holds in or create hold to the body, and then come upstairs. But so far, Alexander was discussed for the fight. And, and, and pounce on him. Time Alexander started the. Well, that was interesting. Time yep. Several the, instances. And the other thing, uh, south paws are not that uncommon in amateur boxing. There's a lot of them. so new trainer, American trainer out of Detroit. Strategy for fighting the south paw, Devin Alexander. Quickly translated for him. Southpaw is not, which creates better punching angles. Alexander and get inside at Katelnik, no matter what, to establish his foot outside Alexander's foot. But so far, there hasn't been all the inside. Good right hand, right on the chin of Alexander. Alexander in the box, favorite coming into this fight. Something like a 9 to 1 favorite. Resume. And, and Katelnik showing for too long. A straight left hand. Timing of Katelnik. Really an extreme pressure fighter is going to beat a faster. Disrupting the speed with Game with our unofficial ringside score. You know, but the guy never stops working. It's amazing how many right jabs he, he lands. It's that left, uh, that straight left hand down round when he outworks it so badly. Katelnik lands an occasional straight right hand. Alexander. That I could also see 1-1. One, one. First round, not a lot happened. St. Louis, Missouri. Devin Alexander in his hometown. 10,000 fans strong taking on Ox Cloud with the we use his physical eyes to negate what his opponent's doing offensively. Because he tries to use them to impose himself offensively. Sometimes early in fights, like against Junior Witter and Juan Urango, he's hit a little bit and looks less than spectacular. As the fight progresses, he looks increasingly... 9,117, the official attendance. To a big setting. Well, that's part of what goes into the career of a special fighter. His, so his belts in front of them. Good straight right hand by Pitelnik. Alexander's in the gym as an amateur or as a pro. Never been dropped. Good round for Alexander. Biggest punch of the round went to Katelman. Back down to this point in the fight. I like how when and emphatically doesn't mess around either in how he tells him.
position and now. He doesn't panic, he's calm. You see his experience quite good because he's not that fast. He's not slow, but he's not blazing fast and he's able to land his... He does this European thing where before he throws the right hand or throw one to Alexander because when Alexander goes on offense, he hits to tell Nick's blows. Doing is just by a plot landed by Katelnik. Oh, good. By, who still may not be in his prime in terms of his him. Without presenting Alexander with a target, he's forcing Alexander to throw punches like there that Arno has landed a good left hand that got Katelnik back up. advantage of that jab down on him. Noticed in Alexander earlier in his career is he would throw the jab but keep the opponent off and against Durango he seemed to throw it with more purpose and land it with, with more authority. Much less defensively responsible fighter than to live up to it is, although he's, he's looking pretty good at the moment. For Katelnik in this round until the last... Good right hand by Katelnik. D tonight, I mean... Uh, gloves. Pretty relaxed in there. Used an analogy about uh, you know Johnson's career, and right now he's at the plate, he's just trying to hit his 600th home run. Yeah. He looks so tight, and he wants it so badly to happen that he's not that way earlier in his career. The Durango fight was so impressive as it seemed to all come together for him. He, um, but Durango had a really good style for Devin, and Katana clearly doesn't. That was in Connecticut, not in front of with the Rams and Holyfield and Mayweather here. And, and there are also rounds here, increasingly, where it's not just Katelnik's doing better than... We almost get the sense that for Alexander, not looking good at this point. Just figure out what's going to be the best way for me to win. Cunningham looked like it would be the right thing. The plan was... At least what they said the plan was going to be. Always get back to the who would you want to be? See, I, I'd want to be Katelnik in this round. Yep, he's, and you see Alexander from that distance on the lead right hand. Unofficial ring set. Well, I tell you, for five rounds away from David Alexander, the way he was working, I mean, Using a straight left hand, moving. Why well, did Katelnik constantly? I thought he should have he'd come back with a left hook after he landed that straight right hand. But in the fifth round, the work rate must have got to Devin Alexander because he really slowed up the offensive. Harold That's says interesting. Yeah, it, 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 that may be true. Because I have a 3-3, three, three, uh -huh. but Harold's... And, and, and the fight, there's a difference. But it, it may be true that Katelnik is not following up his advantage at times, and Devin was throwing the jab a lot, but Devin won a pretty good shot. Their feet got tied up. I think Katelnik actually stepped on his foot, which kept Alexander in range. Alexander starting to throw that right hand to the button. Might be wise. Trying to turn Katelnik to come at him from angles, but he's doing it from a distance, a wide distance, where it's not so easy to step around. Good jab again by Katelnik. Kind of keeps Alexander at bay. By the way, I checked with referee Vic Dracula, and that cut that Alexander sustained a couple of rounds ago in round four was from an accidental clash of heads. And one twos, southpaw. 
not really putting a bunch of punches together. We haven't seen him five shots. And, and primarily that's because the jab isn't landing that much to start the combination. Just to finish up why that's important, if this fight was worse because it was an accidental clash, they'd go to the scorecards. Good counter right hand from Kotelnik as Alexander tries to throw a combination right. Kotelnik is throwing them. They're, they're landing well. They're well placed. Yep. You like the bit. And D get tangled up. Kotelnik reaches with a jab. Steps on Alexander's foot and lands a right hand. Her feet. Alexander should have established early and kept it there. It's interesting. Stacy McKinley in the corner of Kotelnik said, you know, keep working that jab. In the last round, Kotelnik, sure. Alexander. Kotelnik landed more, and he used that jab effectively. I don't know that that's what we have here so far, but it's already a, a minor upset in the sense that it's far from being determined that Alexander was an enormous favorite. You know, I mentioned earlier we got a shot of Floyd Mayweather. Uh, we were hoping to talk with him, but uh, that interview has been declined, so we'll find out what's going on with him. Stays poised. Alexander landed some good shots. Don't talk because a lot of questions for him. Drug testing that Floyd wanted in their first negotiation. A lot of people, I think, fairly said what's going on originally, which Mayweather denies. And secondly, Pacquiao. Oh, some good punches landed yeah. by Kelnick. Left and right. Now Alexander trying to respond back. And responds, he does. I mean, some, a real good straight left hand up the middle from Alexander. Good tough exchanges here. Well, his message to the Rams this week was dig deep. He's digging deep right now against a very tough Kotelnik here in St. Louis. And now the jab is landing. That was setting, it's setting up the straight left hand. Left hand by Kotelnik found the mark. They exchange big shots. Three total points. You know, Max these moments when it feels like Yeah. One thing Kotelnik has to fight against Khan, something he promised being more it's easier to do that when there's a less rangy guy who's not like his Khan did. Amir Khan looks very good right now, by the way. Another good counter right, but Amir Khan had a margin, he beat Kotelnik. Alexander was a good jab by Kotelnik. Serious defensive flaws with Alexander. Clean in this fight. Alexander showing real heart and determining on points. Control of this fight was lost several rounds at 140. Matchups that uh, seem to be reluctant to be for matches to be made. Ready look a little too good. He doesn't look too good tonight. Again with Harold Letterman. And based on those four facts on occasion, but just Kitalix is not busy enough. 89, 82. Eight rounds to one, Devin Alexander. I mean, the guy works constantly. He stops. Devin shots. And, you know, I looked at the rounds in this fight. And that's the problem. How do you guy? Eight to one, Alexander. Uh, four criteria that Harold mentioned, but in the end, a way to, you know, have the emphasis on clean, effective punch. Now, just who they would rather have been in the round. Who's doing more damage? And more damage for all those landing earlier or almost landing earlier that Harold pointed out we just saw Katelnik land Alexander's head the right hand snap back ahead of Alexander yeah Katelnik good left hand by and the hometown fans too Puncture southpaw, advantage of it, and that has not been tonight. If it, the round.
rounds he's won. He has won on his big he round. He, he's lost some rounds. Lost them because he's been hit clean a lot. In this round, he's like busier, this. but he's been getting hit more. I saw the numbers. Alexander digging in. Alexander putting his under 140 pound belts on the line against the former champ, Kotelnik. Right hand over the top, left hand inside from Alexander. St. Louis to see Alexander. I think Alexander, if you see him in the corner, I mean, he's scaring faster. His, his eye is cut, he's rolling his eyes in the corner. But, you know, he's got a lot of heart and he's in great condition. And he's a young guy and he's here. They're confident and strategically in the Alexander corner. That's true, but there's also a lot more to lose. So that can contribute to the Maybe they just thought it'd be easier than it is. Right hand from Katelnik, left Alex blocks most of it. Felt that one, huh, Max? Yeah, I mean, Alexander. By the way, it's another thing. A fighter who punches better than Kadelnik won the title. He stopped Gavin Reese in the. And Alexander does keep doing that. How much better? I imagine a closer. 108, 101, nine rounds. I think that it just outworks the guy constantly, which is what I've been saying to you. He circles, he keeps the fight and moving down the golf balance, and he scores with that right jab. And on the other hand, the town that not enough never can seem to stop Alexander. All right. Seemed to fight with renewed vigor in the 11th, and, and here again in the 12th, but there's Katelnik in between tapping Alexander's land more in the fight. I'm surprised if he was here in St. Louis ahead by a point, but I think Alex is in jeopardy here. Katelnik didn't speak to the Rams, Alexander. But Alexander going straight back with a right hand to Katelnik. The amateur sport. Indian fighters used to beat American fighters in the amateurs. Mm -hmm. Straight right hands. Alexander at this point just trying to gut out the win. Exactly the opposite. fighter at heart. They both land big. There's been long on the intangibles in this fight, but I think a little short on the tangibles, Bob. Hi, hi. Tremendous. Still undefeated. Still champion. Power